season, a season of belief. NBA opening night gives everyone hope. Every fan, love Toronto. Purple and gold. every city, opening night is always something special. Every team, every player. There's always a new energy at the beginning of the season. This year is a different type of year. You gotta have hope, you gotta have faith. You see that look? This game keep us looking up. That's what a ball is. That's where the banner's at. Banner number 17 will soon hang in the rafters. Sure, there's a time to hit the floor. But sometimes you gotta tell gravity, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got something to do. Let's levitate. Hey, do a leaper. Let's go! I'm one of the greatest, ain't no debating on it. I don't know what time it is. From the logo, it's Dane time. Jamal Murray. Jamal Murray! Oh, oh my goodness! The Luka Magic, boy. Vintage wins the game at the buzzer! You see what you got me out here doing? Yeah. Might have threw me off, but can't nobody stop the movement. Uh-uh, let's go. Left foot, right foot, levitating. Pop stars, do a leap with the baby. I had to lace my shoes for all the blessings I was chasing. If I ever slip, I fall into a better situation. New city, new team, same me. It's a different show, and it's a new beginning. A lot of excitement to get back out there. Weight of the world on my shoulders, I kept my head up. Now, baby, stand up. Let it slide. It's time to come home. The city game comes back to the cities that love it. Let's go home! Miami, Brooklyn, got Boston, Dallas, got San Fran, Los Angeles. Then you got my city, Charlotte. I got you. Hope is a launch pad. There's power and power forward. So keep your head up, cause after this year, feel like we all need to rise up with our eyes up. It's the new season of the NBA on TNT. Baby. Yes, it is opening night in the NBA, and it all starts at Barclays Center in Brooklyn, New York. On an overcast 36 degree night. You're looking at the Manhattan Bridge connecting the boroughs of Brooklyn. Manhattan. We're moments away from the Golden State Warriors and the Brooklyn Nets and the NBA on TNT opening night, part of Kia Tip-Off 2020. We welcome you to our studios, uh, Chris Weber, uh, working from Atlanta from Turner Studios and uh, I am in a studio in New York City and coming up the uh, first of our doubleheader featuring three of the biggest stars in the NBA and we will uh, start out Chris talking about Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving and this net team is loaded I would say they can go 10 to what 11 12 deep at this point <laughs> yeah and maybe sometimes you only need this one man kevin durant the four-time nba scoring champ but what's so impressive is that his three years in oakland with golden state he averaged 26 points shooting over 50 percent by the way he has two finals mvps and anytime he's partnered up with the number one pick in the 2011 draft and rookie of the year kyrie irving I think it's up to Kyrie to make sure he sets the table and find that value in every player on this deep team. As you mentioned, Marv, he is the orchestrator. And what better orchestrator do we have than Curry? I'm just happy to see him healthy. I can't wait to see his enthusiasm and his intensity on the court from a former MVP that's just happy to be back on the floor and healthy. All right, Chris, here are tonight's starting lineups presented by Kia. For Golden State on the front line, Andrew Wiggins, second-year man Eric Paschal, and the rookie second pick of the draft, James Wiseman, will start. At the guards, Kelly Oubre, Steph Curry back from uh, the surgery on his left hand. For the Nets up front, Kevin Durant, who's back from that Achilles injury, Joe Harris, DeAndre Jordan in the backcourt, Spencer Dinwiddie, and Kyrie Irving. And there, 
And talking about point guards, any point guard better than this? Well, shout out to Magic Isaiah. You know I, I love you, but it would be no Nash if it weren't for those. How yeah. about this 18-year playing career? Just the eight-time NBA All-Star, five-time assist leader. And I think that his patience, his temperament, and the fact that he made guys better on the fly, I can't wait to see Steve Nash start his head coaching career here tonight in Brooklyn. And talking with Steve earlier, I, I said, is there anxiety? He said... Well, it's not exactly anxiety, uh, which would be overwhelming, but maybe a little bit in coaching in his first NBA game. This the 75th anniversary of the NBA, and we get underway on this 22nd day of December. And, of course, due to the pandemic, there are no fans in the stands. The head coach of the Warriors, Steve Kerr, coming off a 15 and 50 season worst record of the NBA this after three NBA titles in five years for uh, Steve Kerr's seventh season as head coach of the Warriors and uh, certainly looking to turn it from last year's injury hit uh, depleted roster the officiating crew Zach Zarba